guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for joining me for today's video. We are gonna be taking Joel and Dahlia on a romantic vacation. Their son, Ash, and their puppy, Jax, is out at the grandparents' house, so they can just enjoy their time together in a beautiful world. I did download some new lots in Tartosa, so I'm excited to check those out in this part. And um, I think Joel and Dahlia are really excited about it too because um, as soon as I loaded in and like started playing, they literally were woohooing in the closet and I did not make them do that. So I think they're very excited for their vacation. But yes, we're gonna go ahead and travel to Tartosa. I'm so excited. I also did download the nectar making mod by Ice Mun Mun. So we're gonna kind of have that in this part too. I think it just fits so beautifully in the world there. And I tried to like make a little community garden where they could go get some like grapes and things for their uh, nectar making. But yeah, we're just gonna have fun and kind of explore the new world a little bit more. I haven't gotten to play a whole lot with wedding stories yet. Um, I've done one little vacation there and then I did Leah and Finn's like vow renewal. This rental lot that they're staying at is one of the new lots that I put into the world. I'll try to like link them all or give you guys information on each of them that we go to in this part in case you want them for your game. But yeah, it's a really beautiful lot and I thought it was perfect for them. The right side here had a kids room and I actually did change it to be a sauna. So if you download this, it will have the kids room. You can, you know, keep it that way or change it if you want to. But um, I thought it was more fitting for them to have a little sauna because on this getaway, they're really going to focus on relaxation. Also just spending quality time together and then the nectar making as well. For Dahlia, I did give her one of the wellness aspirations uh, so she can kind of work on that. I think Dahlia is probably very much into self-care and, you know, pampering herself from time to time. So I wanted to kind of do that a little bit more. And then for Joel, since he is a mixologist, I thought it was perfect for him to kind of get into nectar making as well. So there is a little garden here on the lot that they'll kind of like tend to. And then I did put the nectar making station down below this like little shed area. So he'll go down there and kind of work on that sometimes. I'm hoping we'll get like actual nectar making in The Sims at some point. I think it should have been with Wedding Stories. That's kind of my biggest complaint so far, other than, you know, it not really working well and it being really glitched. That's probably the biggest complaint. But I do think they should have added nectar making for something else to do other than when you're like getting married or having ceremonies and things like that in that pack. But anyway, Joel and Dahlia are starting out their vacation kind of getting, you know, unpacked and relaxed. Uh, Joel is going to make them some drinks and they've got a nice fire going and they're just going to kind of get used to the place they're staying at. I also gave them these new outfits and I think they're so nice on them. I love this skirt on Dahlia. I think she looks so beautiful and I think Joel looks very relaxed and yeah, I'm just excited for their little trip out to Tartosa. Zoya Malabla. Kiss -a <laughs> Ooh. So after they got settled into the rental lot, Joel and Dahlia went out to the beach and Dahlia, her plan was just to relax. She laid out on a towel and got some sun and, you know, couldn't be bothered. And then Joel was like swimming laps in the ocean. But yeah, this was a really nice little beach I downloaded recently. I'll try to give you guys the information. So if you want it in your game, it has a lot of fun things for them to do. A lot of things from Island Living. So they had a really nice time. But yeah, Joel was just swimming laps and I did make him rest a little bit and like do a little bit of the back floating interaction and then he started swimming again. But um, yeah, and then there was all these Sims like doing little sand castles. It was so cute. <laughs> and my plan was for Joel to grill over here, but unfortunately I think something was in the way. He wasn't able to you know, get over there and grill. So um, I eventually have them go over to the Indian food stall and they get some dinner there. After a while, Dahlia yeah. gets a tan and she takes a little break and makes sure to hydrate so she gets some juice and puts on some lotion. But yeah, after they take a little break, I decide to have them go get some dinner and kind of explore the town a bit more. Soup. Have been 
Badinka. Badish. Sip a canal. Pimba. Martha Wick. Badish. Rubin. Shabby Dazzle. Okay, I poop it too. Rabobi. Sacramento, Mansa. Sime. Abbasan. They finish their dinner as the sun sets. It's such a beautiful sunset too, and this world is just very romantic. I love all the lights and everything about it, but they finish their dinner, and then afterwards, I take them to this other lot that I installed, which is like a wine bar or like, you know, nectar bar, but they come here and they have a little bit of nectar. And I do hire a guitarist and I try to get them to like kind of listen to some live music. It doesn't really go very well. I think they kind of are able to listen to some, but yeah, it's just a really pretty lot. And I think it is really nice and just pretty with the sunset and all the open like arches. This would definitely be a world that I would love to visit in real life. I think it's just so pretty. But yeah, this is kind of how they end their night. They just have a few drinks and kind of spend some time together, listen to some music. Oh, I also did start a date for them because Joel needed to get gold on another date. So once they finish this date, he has that level of the aspiration done. Oh, I think he has the whole aspiration done, actually. Um, so that was really great because I was really wanting him to have the soulmate aspiration and like the um, trait that comes with it because he is just infatuated with Dahlia and he has been ever since he kind of like laid eyes on her. But yeah, they finish up there, then they come back to the rental lot, and they have to like kind of get in the sauna. They hadn't yet, so they were like, we've got to test it out and check it out. So they both go in there and just have a little relaxing time before bed. So I am kind of working on Dahlia's aspiration here. She's supposed to do like relaxing things, um, so she does that. So, so terrific. Oh. <laughs> And then for Joel, I did go ahead and give him a new aspiration since he completed the soulmate one. It's the one with the animals, so I thought that would be good because he really loves their dog Jax and he really wanted to get them an animal or a pet. So we'll kind of work on that when they get home. But yeah, they woohoo for the night and then in the morning they wake up. I did go and get a yoga mat for Dahlia to work on some yoga since I think that'll be good for her aspiration. And then Joel is already up. He got up really early to go for a jog. He's a very energetic person, so I thought that was good for him. I also do like to have my Sims go on jogs because I feel like I get to kind of like check out the world a little bit more. But then he did get glitched on this bridge. Um, I accidentally like stopped his jog midway through the bridge. So yeah, that wasn't a good deal. But he makes his way back and Dahlia is doing her yoga routine. I hadn't tried out the family friendly one yet. Um, so that was kind of cool to check out. I think that was with the spa update, but yeah, so she's working on that. I thought it would be nice for her to kind of do some yoga because Joel is so fitness oriented. I think it's nice for Dahlia to kind of be in it to it too, but in her own way. So I think I'm going to have her do yoga a little more often. But yeah, I'm just having Joel kind of work on the garden a bit. They did have some, you know, different fruits and produce in their inventory. So I used that to kind of, you know, make the garden a little more or have a little more variety. And then for some reason, Dahlia wanted hot dogs at, you know, 10 a.m. after her yoga. That was her craving, I guess. So she has a hot dog. And then I went ahead and had Joel check out the nectar making Unfortunately, we can only make apple wine, but I do plan on bringing them back here and kind of doing some more nectar making. I think it'd be really neat if like Joel could maybe make his own brand of nectar or something and then like sell it at his bar. Um, so maybe we'll do something like that. Ooh, keep that there. And I thought it would be really sweet for Joel to give Dahlia a foot massage since we have the massage chair and it was just a really cute interaction. She's kind of like talking about her day or, you know, whatever's on her mind and he's giving her a little foot massage. But I don't think he's very good at it because she looks like she's in pain at some points. And after some more time in the sauna and relaxing, I do have them get some of their apple nectar. However, I do think after like massages and being in a sauna, you have to like drink a lot of water. <laughs> so they're not really doing that. They're drinking a lot of nectar, but oh well, I guess they're on, you know, a vacation. So 
But yeah, they seem to like the wine. They have, you know, good moodlets for that. And they get really romantic and flirty. And I wanted them to slow dance. So they come over here and slow dance. And it's a really cute interaction. However, I do feel like it's kind of short. Like I can never get my Sims to dance for very long. And it's also a little bit like glitchy. Like it doesn't seem very smooth. Also, I do wish there was like added interactions where they can like kiss or hug or you know get a little closer or whatever kind of like in the other games they had so yeah i wish the slow dancing was a little bit better than it is like I, i've had a mod before where they can slow dance and i think that one's probably better than the one we have in the game oh. And then it is the next day and they actually go to a real spa. So they're definitely very much pampering themselves on this vacation. But this is another lot that I have in my game that I'll try to give you guys the information for. I did change up this lot a little bit. I can't quite remember exactly what I changed up. I think I made it more of like a couple's massage up here with the massage table and the chairs. But yeah, they both get some massages. I think Dahlia gets the stone massage and Joel gets a sports massage since he's always active and running around and all that. But yeah, it's just so relaxing. I love the spa day pack, especially with the refresh. It's really, really nice. Um, and yeah, they just have a nice little massage. And then I do get Dahlia to get her nails done um, to a really pretty blue color that will match her skirt really nicely. And also you probably already noticed, but everyone has a bag on their head. I think it has the um, neighborhood, I forget what they're called, but the neighborhood thing where, um, you know, they all wear bags or whatever. So that's kind of annoying. I wish it was easy to, you know, change that really quick. I don't know if you can with MC Command Center or how I would do that. I think I'd have to go into like a residential lot and change it that way. But anyway, so yeah, everyone's wearing bags on their head. It's kind of funny. But then Dahlia does a little bit of meditating and Joel orders a drink and I think he got in the hot springs at one point. And then after all of that, once they're fully relaxed and having a great time, I bring them out to the lounge just for, you know, some time together to kind of end their vacation because this is their last night. So they're just going to go out and maybe get something to eat and spend some time together. But yeah, that's about it for their vacation. This is their last night, so they're going to be packing up and going home soon. After the lounge, I do have them kind of go to the beach and dig in the sand piles a bit. I did want to see if we could find some more messages in a bottle. But yeah, I just, I love bringing my Sims here to Tartosa. And Dolly goes for a little swim. It does get cloudy pretty quick, so they don't stay too long. But yeah, it was just a really nice little vacation for them. I enjoy seeing them together and being all in love. It's so cute. I really hope you guys enjoyed this part, and I had a lot of fun making this video for you guys. So thank you so, so much for watching, and I will see you all very, very soon. Bye!